Hey y'all, this is Kylie from Wild Lemon Fitness. Thanks so much for joining us in our online studio. Let's work out. Welcome to Wild Lemon TV. I appreciate all of you being here with me. My name is Nancy Lanaza. I'm a yoga teacher here in Pensacola, Florida. I've been teaching yoga for almost 40 years. My focus today for this class will be movement, of course, as always, standing poses, particularly triangle pose. I've always felt that a day without a triangle pose is a day without a triangle pose. All right, let's move. Inhale, take a big stretch up, really reach long through both sides of your body. And on the next exhale, reach way out to the right side. Press that right hand away from you, left arm strongly alongside your left ear. And I'm a breath counter. Inhale and exhale one. Inhale, and exhale two. Inhale, exhale three. Inhale, exhale four. Inhale, exhale five. Inhale, big reach up, lengthening through both sides again. Next exhale, reach out to the left. Slide that hand away. Press the left hand into your mat. Keep your right hip down. Inhale, long through the right side. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale and exhale inhale come back up big stretch through both sides exhale reach your arms straight out to the sides from your shoulders let your palms face up inhale reach your arms back squeeze your shoulder blades to the spine take your gaze up and exhale bring your arms forward fingertips touch chin to your chest inhale open palms up Gaze is up, exhale, reaching forward, fingertips touching in, curl in. One more time, inhale, reach up, open, exhale, reach forward, and curl in. Inhale, reach up, long through both sides, exhale, to the right, place your left hand on your right knee, right hand behind your back, I'm on my fingertips. Look over your right shoulder. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more. Inhale and exhale come back to center take that big stretch up and exhale to the left right hand on your left knee left hand behind your back looking over that shoulder inhale exhale make sure you're reaching up through the crown of your head exhale inhale exhale Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Good. Inhale, come center. One more time. Reach your arms up really long. Inhale, arms out to the side as you exhale. Sweep your feet around to one side now so that you can come on to your hands and knees. Bring your knees to the edges of your mat. 
Let your big toes touch, your heels are apart. Inhale and exhale. Take your hips back. You've made that nice little saddle there for your feet. Slide your arms forward. Release your forehead toward the mat. Keep your arms really active. Inhale. Exhale, forearms and elbows stay off the floor. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and Exhale. Inhale. Come back up to hands and knees. Bring your knees right underneath your hips now. Relax the tops of your feet down. Try not to have your toes turned in here, pointing straight back. We're going to do a couple of cat cows. So inhale and take the cat. That means you tuck your tailbone in, you tuck your chin in, you press up between your shoulder blades. And then exhale, take the cow, lift your sitting bones, lift your gaze, drop the belly down. Inhale, really fill up the backs of your lungs as you arch your spine into cat. And exhale, be that sway-backed old cow, oh. One more time, inhale, press up into the cat. Exhale, take your cow. Now, inhale, come to a neutral spine, and then come back, hips to heels. I call this wisdom pose. As you come down for this one, reach your arms forward. Now let your forearms come down. Inhale, turn your palms to face up. Lift the hands up. Bring your fingertips over the backs of your shoulders, forehead to the mat. Walk your elbows a little farther forward here. Get a big stretch in the backs of your upper arms. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, stretch your arms back out, palms come down. Inhale, releasing from wisdom pose right into downward facing dog. Come to your down dog, maybe you need to walk your feet back a little bit. I like to keep my feet hip width apart here in my dog. Lift the sitting bones, press back through your inner thighs. Keep your ears in line with your upper arms, inhale. Exhale, feel your heels releasing toward the floor. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, one more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Come forward to plank. Really move toward the tips of your toes. Take your gaze forward. The thighs are lifting. Inhale, so your legs are very active here. And exhale, let your knees come down again. So you're back on your hands and knees. Relax the tops of your feet down. Inhale, I'm gonna take my left leg back first. Lift your left leg up, relax your left foot. So just hold the leg up with your leg and not your foot. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Inhale, sweep your left leg out to the side. Now bring that foot down onto the floor. Maybe your left heel is lined up with your right knee. Let your left toes be pointing forward. Inhale a breath here. Tilt your pelvis up a bit and then exhale. Take your hips back. Inhale, you're gonna stay here. Exhale. 
Inhale, how far back do the hips go? That's up to you. Inhale, exhale, enjoy your practice. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale, exhale, good. Inhale, back to hands and knees. Sweep that left leg back and up. One more breath there. Relax the foot. Inhale and exhale. Let your left knee come down. Take a breath here. Inhale and exhale. Right leg, inhale. Take it back and up. Relax the right foot. I like to kind of jiggle it out. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, nice, straight, and strong arms. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more, inhale, and exhale. Inhale, sweep your right leg out to the side. Let that foot come down. You're on the sole of the foot. Toes are pointing forward. Inhale, lift the sitting bones just a little bit. And again, exhale. Take your hips back, bringing them to where you want them to be. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, one more breath, inhale, and exhale, inhale, come back to hands and knees, sweep the left leg back, let that foot go, inhale, and exhale, bring your right knee down, good. Inhale, one more wisdom pose here. Take your hips back towards your feet, stretch your arms forward, bring your forehead down. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, good. Inhale, back to hands and knees. Sweep your feet around, move your hips back. You're gonna sit down. It's a good time to rearrange your shirt. Stretch your legs out straight ahead. Now here, bring your feet so that they're mat width apart. I like to take my hands and sort of spiral my thighs inward. That way I can really feel my sitting bones. Inhale, arms reaching up. Again, that big stretch up. And exhale, reaching forward. I'm bringing my hands to the outer edges of my feet. Maybe yours don't get there. They're great on the legs, on the floor. Inhale, and I want you to just let the upper body sink down. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale, and exhale, good. Inhale, take that big reach up. Now as you exhale, let your arms come forward. Let your palms face up. Inhale, lift up through the crown of your head. Exhale, bring the chin to the chest. You're gonna roll down. Always look behind you to see, make sure there's nothing there. And exhale, you're all the way down onto your back. Fingertips up to the ceiling. Inhale, lift your right leg up. Now reach up, what are you gonna hold on to? Well, I can hold on to my foot. You can hold on to the back of your calf. You can hold on even to the back of your thigh. If you have a belt, you can use a belt, scarf, whatever you've got. Inhale, exhale, inhale, 
Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Now take your left palm, place it on top of your left thigh. Your right hand, if you're holding your foot, you can hold on to the right big toe with the first two fingers of your right hand. You can also have your right hand on the inside of your foot, calf, thigh, right? Inhale or use your belt and exhale. Now the right leg goes out to the side. Not onto the floor, just out to the side. You want to keep your left heel, hip, and shoulder blade on your mat. Inhale, your gaze is up at the ceiling. Exhale, watch the ceiling fan go around. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, Exhale, one more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, bring your right leg up. Exhale, lengthen it forward and down. Take a pause here and notice how to right and left feel. Inhale and exhale. All right, inhale, left leg up. All right, and again, you're going to reach up. First two fingers of your left hand may be around that big toe. Left hand on the inside of the foot, the calf, your ankle, whatever you can get. Actually, I'm going to use both hands here on my left foot. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Remember to keep your right leg active as well. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, one more breath here. Inhale, and exhale. Now I'm going to hold on to that big toe with the first two fingers of my left hand. My right palm is on my right thigh. My right palm is there just to remind my right leg to be active and to be moving downward toward the mat. Inhale, left leg out to the left side. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Let's take one more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Good. Inhale, let that left leg come up and take it forward and down. All right. And take a pause here. Inhale and exhale. Walk your feet in. Get your heels right in front of your sitting bones. And then take your knees apart. And as the knees come apart, you'll feel the soles of your feet press against each other. Just rest your hands right there on your thighs. Relax your shoulders. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Good. Lift your knees up. Arms alongside your body. Knees toward your chest. Stretch your legs up to the ceiling. Reach your fingertips up to the ceiling. Inhale. As you exhale, lift your head. You'll feel your shoulder blades come up. Look at your knees, and you'll come right up to sit. Let me turn and face this way. And bring the soles of your feet together in front of you. Rearrange your shirt if you need to. All right. All right. Bring your heels in close to the center of your body. Take your right leg out to the right side. So left heel on the inside of your left thigh, left toes point toward that right knee. Inhale, lift both arms up, long through both sides of the body. Breathe in, reaching out to the right side now. 
Bring your right hand down on the inside of that leg, wherever it comes, left arm alongside your left ear. Inhale, you can turn your gaze to look up to the left. You can keep your gaze straight ahead. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. We're going to do one more breath here because I lost count. Inhale and exhale. Good. All right. Inhale, bring yourself back up. Slide that right foot in. There's the soles of your feet together one more time. Heels are in close. And then take your left leg out. All right. Point your right foot so those toes point toward the inside of your left leg. Inhale, reach up, big stretch up. And then out to the left side. Left hand down on the inside of that leg, just wherever it lands. Right arm alongside your right ear. Inhale, you can look up past your right upper arm, looking up at the ceiling. I don't know about you, but I've done a lot of ceiling gazes the last two and a half years during the pandemic. So I'm going to look forward. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Don't worry if your breath doesn't sink with mine. I'm just doing this to remind you to breathe. Inhale, and myself as well. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Inhale, and bring yourself back up. All right. Soles of your feet come back together. Slide your heels forward. So I'm looking at my heels. They're about two feet away from the center of my body. I've made this nice diamond shape with my legs. If I cut it in half at the knees, I get a triangle. Perfect. Inhale, reach your arms up. Now tilt your pelvis forward. Lengthening forward. Keep your upper arms in line with your ears as long as you can. And then when you're ready, bring your hands down. Inhale. So I'm going to come down onto my forearms because I can. Inhale and forehead down to the feet. Exhale. Don't worry if your forehead doesn't get to your feet. This has been 40 years of work here. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, we take one more breath here. Inhale, and exhale. Reach your arms forward. Inhale, lift yourself up, big stretch up. Let your arms come out and down. Sweep your feet around to one side so that you can come up standing on your knees, right? So kneeling. Take your right leg out to the right side. So you want to line your right heel up with your left knee. My right toes are pointing out. If that is uncomfortable for you, your right foot can turn in so that the toes are pointing forward. If you're going to do it this way, just be mindful of how the inside of your knee feels. Inhale, arms are going to reach up. Again, we do a lot of reaching up here. Exhale, reach out over your right leg. Let your right hand come down on that shin reaching for the ankle. Left arm is alongside the left ear. Inhale, your gaze is where you'd like it to be. You can look up to the left, you can look forward. You can look at your right foot. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale, and exhale. Good. Inhale, and bring yourself up. Let your right knee come down in line with the left. Take a breath here. Pause. Inhale, 
and exhale. All right, left leg out to the left side. Heel lined up with the right knee, toes pointing out or pointing forward. Inhale, arms reaching up, cramp in the left foot, yeah, okay. Reach way out over that left leg. Slide the hand down to the ankle, right arm is alongside the right ear. Where are you looking? Wherever you want to. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. And inhale, come up. There's that big stretch up. Let your arms come down. Left knee next to the right. Inhale, take a pause. And exhale. All right, I'm gonna turn to the side. Back to hands and knees. Inhale, back to downward facing dog pose, which is a triangle shape. How about that? Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Now, inhale, take your left leg back and up. Lift it up as high as you can, pressing your right heel down. Keep the weight even over both of your hands. Inhale and exhale. Now bend your left knee, bring that left heel towards your left sitting bone. Inhale, come forward, left knee to the left elbow. Then flex your left foot and slide it to the outside of your left hand. Inhale, straighten that left leg as much as you can. Inhale, you can press down through the inner edge of your left foot. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, bend your left knee. Now, bring your right knee down. I'm gonna keep my right foot flexed. Press your left hand to the top of your left knee. Press down into that knee. Chin away from your chest as you look out to the left side. Inhale, keep the inner edge of your left foot pressing into the floor. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Left hand comes back down onto the mat. Inhale, take your gaze forward for a breath. Back to downward facing dog pose. As you exhale, take a couple of breaths here. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Take your right leg back and up. Reach it up. Press your left heel down. Inhale. Exhale. Bend your right knee. Heel toward the right sitting bone. Inhale, bring your right knee to your right elbow. Flex your right foot. Slide it to the outside of your right hand. Inhale, straighten your right leg. Exhale, as much as you can. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. 
Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Bend that right knee. Let your left knee come down. I'm going to stay on the backs of my left toes. Bring your right hand on top of your right knee. Press straight down with that right palm. Chin away from your chest. Look out to the right side. Pardon me for having my back to you. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Bring your right hand back down to the mat. Inhale. And press your right foot back to downward facing dog pose. Take a breath here in your down dog. Inhale. Exhale. I used to tell my yoga students that down dog was a resting pose. That's not true. Inhale. Exhale. One more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Bring your feet halfway to your hands. Take your hands back to your feet. Line your fingertips up with your toes. It's a good spot to rearrange your shirt. Fingertips lined up with your toes. Inhale, turn your hands so your palms face forward. And then exhale, walk your hands back and fold into your legs. Inhale, if you wanna have the knees soft here, you may do that. If you have two yoga blocks or big thick books at home, they can come underneath your hands. Inhale, sometimes the floor feels very far away. You're allowed to lift it up to you. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, one more breath here. Inhale and exhale. Bending your knees, really feel the front of your body on top of your thighs. Bring your fingertips in line with your toes. Inhale, reach your arms forward. Coming all the way up to stand. Exhale, let your arms come out and down. Now, take a nice wide stance on your mat. What does a nice wide stance mean? A nice wide stance means that you feel, as you take your arms out to the side from your shoulders, you feel like your wrists are over your ankles. I don't know if they are, but they feel like they are. Turn your right foot out. Inhale, come way out over that right leg, reach. Bring your right hand on the shin, it slides toward the ankle. Inhale, where are you looking? Classical yoga tells us to look up toward the left hand. I like to look straight ahead. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Let's take two more breaths here. Inhale, Exhale, last one. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, come up. Let your arms come down. Oop, fall down. Wipe your nose. Turn your right foot in. Turn your left foot out. All right. Inhale, reach out. Big stretch out. And way out over that left leg. Slide the hand down the shin to the ankle. You can use a block here on the outside of the ankle if you want to bring the floor up. Right arm is straight up. You can look up towards your right hand. I'm going to look straight ahead. You could even look down at your left foot. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, one more breath, inhale, and exhale, and inhale, come up, turn that left foot in, let your arms come down, 
heel toe, your feet in. Bring them underneath your hips. Place your hands on your hips. Shift your weight to your left foot. Inhale, lift your right knee. Bring your right hand to your right ankle. You're gonna guide that foot to the inside of your left thigh. Inhale, palms together, tree pose. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, one more breath here, inhale, and exhale. Let that right foot come down, hands back on your hips. Shift the weight to the right foot. Inhale, let your left knee come up. Reach your left hand for that ankle. Guide the foot to the inside of your right thigh. If your foot doesn't go to your right thigh, no worries. You can take this nice kickstand pose. It can come to the inside of your calf. Bring your palms together. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, Whoop. exhale, trees fall down, inhale, and exhale. Back with both feet underneath your hips. Inhale, take a big stretch up, really reach. Exhale forward and down. Your fingertips are in line with your toes. Just give your hips a little wiggle here. Nod your head, shake your head, whatever you need to do. Inhale, you're gonna bend your knees, bring your hips down, stretch your legs out straight ahead. Bring your right foot to the outside of your left thigh. Bend your left knee. Inhale, reach both arms up. Left elbow on the outside of your right leg. Right hand behind your back, looking over your right shoulder. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, come center. Nice counter twist over to the left, back to center, stretch your legs out, left foot on the outside of your right thigh, bend your right knee, that heel's on the outside of your left hip. Inhale, reach up, right elbow on the outside of your left leg, left hand head, looking over your left shoulder. Inhale, exhale, Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Inhale, come forward, nice counter twist over to the right. Come back to center. Bring the soles of your feet together again. This time your heels are in close to the center of your body. Bring your hands to the mat in front of you, the floor in front of you. Inhale, reaching up through the crown of your head. Feel the pelvis tilt forward, walk the hands forward. You can rest on your forearms here. Hands can be on blocks. They can rest on the floor. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, one more breath here. Inhale, and exhale. Walk your hands in, and then cross your ankles in front of you. Inhale, just as we did as we started out. Reach your arms out, let your palms face up. Inhale, lift your gaze, squeeze your shoulder blades together. This time as you exhale and the arms come forward, cross your elbows, give yourself a big hug here. Hug in, 
Inhale, open again, look up. Recross with the opposite elbow on top, that big hug again. Bring yourself up, reach your arms out, look up one more time. Bring your palms together. Take a deep breath in, inhale. And exhale. This is the perfect time for you to stretch your legs out in front of you, roll down onto your back, taking a few moments of rest. Thank you so much for joining us, Wild Lemon TV today. Again, my name is Nancy Lanaza. I teach something called Abaya Yoga. I so appreciate you spending this time with me. Thank you.